breaking overnight. Congress reaches a bipartisan deal providing $13.6 billion in aid to Ukraine and European allies. An air alert was declared overnight in and around Kyiv with residents urged to get to bomb shelters. Thousands continue to flee under a temporary Russian ceasefire as more than 2 million have already fled. A Russian airstrike in the northern city of Sumy killed several civilians. Meanwhile, the Biden administration rejected Poland's plan to arm Ukrainian forces with more air power. Poland was prepared to transfer its fighter jets to U.S. forces in Germany with an understanding they'd be given to Ukraine while the U.S. replenishes its arsenal. But the Pentagon says this could drag the U.S. and NATO into the war and further escalate tensions with Russia.